Yeah, we are. What's up, guys? Hello. We have had a super busy day, but Sammy, our elf, he did have it saying six days right here in chocolate chips, but some little girl over there, she ate, it. <laughs> she ate them. So um, we bought this a few days ago, but Sammy set it up right here. So I think that means he wants us to do it tonight. It is a great night for us to do something fun and festive at home. Cody is gone. He had a corporate Christmas party that he was photographing tonight. So that's where he's at. But me and these four cuties and this little cutie in his orange. Hi, buddy. <laughs> we are going to have some gingerbread fun. We're gonna build it on here, right? Mm -hmm. On that festive charger. And you guys, look at this. We have a lot of assembly to do. Here are the instructions. Mm -hmm. So we have got to get crackalack in. This is cool, guys, look. It looks like wood and straw and bricks. Yeah. Pretty cool. A That's a pig and sheep. That's and what's a that, Ken Man? And all them are sexy. And, <laughs> and that? that's a cow. And that's a cow? Look at it. <laughs> we got the frosting in the piping bag and we're gonna start assembling. That is gonna be cool. Is that what you do? Okay, start placing those, Bubba. Precision cars. Good job, Bubba. Oh, I'm nervous about this. Yeah. abandoned our project huh? <laughs> so it's just me and these boys but Hello. they were singing the song and I said who sings that and I said it's one of your mom's favorites and what did you say <laughs> what did you say Baxter boys you said the Baxter boys and I said Baxter <laughs> you mean Backstreet yes the Backstreet boys. Nope. <laughs> it was really really cute and sweet but you guys this barnyard Gingerbread house is looking pretty dang awesome. Stylish. Stylish. And look at this cow. Your cow is amazing. Carsey's silo is amazing. Oh, it looks so good. And Koei is being so nice over there. Hi. Mommy, where could I put this? The Baxter boy. Where could I put this? <laughs> oh, snap. Oh snap, there's the final product. You were the only two that stayed hanging with mom. Bones on that one. 
I made most of it. You guys did awesome. It looks so great. I love the little barnyard. The only thing I did is all this. this. Oh, and you then I did. <laughs> it looks so, so good. I love it. You know what I mean? All right, there you go, Sammy. We did it just for you. Now we need to eat some dinner. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. I've been folding and doing so much laundry today. High five. Is that some good apples? apples? How come you stopped making the gingerbread house with us? You know why I don't know? Because I do not I'm gonna see that and I'm just doing the same thing back it. You were dancing? Uh-huh. Yeah. So, let me see. And I was doing the like same thing I should Show us the dance. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. Oh Me and the kids were dancing, and then I pulled my phone out to Snapchat Koda because he was being so cute and funny. And then he refused to dance because I was trying to film him. So then him and Carson were doing the Try Not to Dance challenge, and I played their favorite songs. Was it hard? I was yeah. kicking my foot to the beat. You were? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> you weren't? You stayed strong? Maybe. I did. Maybe. And then Canyon comes out just to jamming, huh? He's like, moving. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, <laughs> I love you guys so much. Are you dancing too? I'm dancing too. What? Okay, okay, let's see it, Tiny. Round off. Okay. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Did we have fun dancing tonight? I'm like, Ooh. I'm like crazy for us. <laughs> all right, I'm trying to get them all calmed down, but it is family time with Santa, you guys. It's family time with Santa. Five more nights. Five more nights. Five more nights. What? Five more nights. What, Kuyoli? Here I am in a real fire truck. I have. Hey, English and Carson. Go to the dark city on the phone. All right, teeth all brushed. Mm -hmm. Ready for bed? Five nights till Christmas, buddy. Uh, and Carsey boy, tomorrow is your last day of school before Christmas vacation. Yes! Can you even believe that? It's Friday, it's the last day. Five more yes. nights! I love you guys so much. Hey, I love you. Give me your book. I love you, but we gotta turn the lights off. Hey, Dakota and Carson. And Tiny Bean, your mom is very proud of you guys today. Yes. Thank you so much for being such good boys today. You're welcome. I love you guys. And I'm very, very proud of you. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Almost. <coughs> Merry Christmas. Almost. Merry Christmas. Almost. Merry Christmas. <laughs> love you guys. Finally got all of those cuties to bed. It was such a great day you guys. Cody was just able to FaceTime them. Um, his photo shoot just ended so he FaceTimed them before I put them to bed so they got to say goodnight to him. I think he kind of put Dakota and Carson up to something today because he started asking them how many numbers they had. Dakota said 12. I don't know what he said to the boys this morning or what they worked out between each other but <laughs> they were 
such good boys today. Like Coda and Carson are always great kids, but Coda walked in the door from school and he immediately walked straight up to me and just gave me a giant hug. It just made my day. And then anything I asked, usually if I ask something, I might have to ask a few times or say, Dakota, will you please do that? But I didn't even ask specifically one person to do anything. I would just say, hey, will someone go get Cohen's bottle out of his crib? Like I just asked one time, generally said it, anyone could have done it, and Dakota was like up and going. Like he was just so helpful and thoughtful today. And I'm just so grateful for awesome kids, you guys. I'm grateful for this time of year when we can focus on serving each other and showing our love for one another. It just really is such a special time. I got several messages today and they were all so kind and thoughtful, but I got an email today that really, really just touched me. I don't think I'll ever forget the words that were in that email. It was just, it meant a lot to me. It was very kind and sincere and it was just some things that I really needed to hear today. So you know who you are who wrote me that email. Thank you so much. I, I truly do love you and thank you. From the bottom of my heart, thank you for writing me that email. It's been a wonderful day, you guys. We still haven't figured out anything with the car situation. Cody had work and then he had to leave work early and go straight to that corporate Christmas party that he was photographing. So I was just home all day and we didn't have time to go look at a dealership or anything like that. So we're still just trying to price some things out, figure out what our best options are. My sweet grandma Carol, she also had surgery today. So um, my dad and mom have been at the hospital with her so it's kind of been a quiet day around here. That's why I didn't feel much before the kiddos got home from school. But I, I've just been feeling overwhelmed with gratitude today. And so I just wanted to express that to you guys and say how much I love you and how grateful I am for the relationships that we've built through this online community and just how grateful I am that I have so many amazing people that are on this journey of life with me. Um, it really means the world to me. So. It's been a great day. We're still figuring some things out with the cars, but it's gonna be, it's all gonna be okay. My amazing best friend texted me earlier and she asked if we wanted to use one of her vehicles this weekend. So we just fill in the love you guys and I'm just so grateful. So I am going to fold some laundry, wait for Cody to get home. And then I think I'll wait to close it out with him. But I just wanted to say those things really quick grateful for this season and the spirit of giving and the amount of love that you can just feel in the air this time of year. So hope you guys are feeling that too. And if you're not, I hope you guys are feeling it too, at least from me because I truly do care about each one of you and Merry Christmas and happy holidays. It's so late. Look at a barnyard we need. What? Isn't that cute? So cute. <laughs> he done good, baby. He done real the good. The kids did. The like, kids done real good. <laughs> Seriously, all I did was the tractor. They did awesome. Awesome. Jealous. I wish I could have been there. <laughs> when we were making it, I was like, oh. I don't know, well Kodo was like, mom, I want you to do icicles all around it. So I started trying, I'm like, buddy, I don't know how, it's not working. And he goes, I really wish dad was here. <laughs> so you were missed too. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> hey guys, I'm happy he's home. Me too, it's good to be home. How was it? It was awesome, it was yeah. super cool, yeah. Christmassy? Christmassy, a lot of portraits basically. That's Just awesome. I took a portrait of like everyone there. That's so. awesome probably 400 people there, so it was a long night. Holy cow. It went good. Awesome. Well, missed you. Glad you made it safe. Mm. And yeah, I wanted to wait for you to close out the vlog. Thank you. You're welcome. I made an appearance today. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching. We love you and we will see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. We got the fry sting. Fry sting.